Hello you, welcome back to Geekism. I've got a few things to fix from the last episode. Thank you so much to all the people who shouted out at me in the comments. I'm really, really glad that you comment on these videos because you're really teaching me so much. It really is so, so useful. Uh, one of the problems was we had a little uh, sort of thing that wouldn't go away here, a little tea thing. It turned out it was a bus route. Thank you to everyone who pointed that out. I have now completely redone the bus route. I've also done a little bit of decorating to this little island off camera, put a little bit of a pond in the middle. Bit of a uh, bit of stuff down there just to make it look a little bit more interesting. I think it looks quite nice. Um, somebody else said that the uh, if you're using overhead roads through a city like this, um, that you really should be having the uh, two lane highway. I think is what we actually used, wasn't it? The ones with the barriers up. But I've got a feeling there isn't a two way two way highway with sound barriers. Oh, there we go. Let's see if we can do that then. But are you? back and forth or no you're still the same one aren't you okay great so what do you actually do see surely they already are saying barriers but I guess if the game thinks they are then then it probably helps out it makes people a little upgrade cannot go an existing road of another type huh how weird like it kind of makes sense but it just doesn't seem to be that it wants us to do it. So, but I mean, like, there are, like, technically there are barriers there. You know, it actually doesn't look that much different. It also automatically puts the same barriers on once they're raised up, perhaps. So, yeah, good idea, but maybe if we do a flat, a flat one, we'll put the same barriers in. Like, they've, they've already got them here, look, they, and they look good. So, I suppose if we work, if we fill up this area a little bit eventually when we redo this to offices... Then that's uh, that's probably a good idea to do this bit with sand barriers. Okay, uh, what else? I think that was about it, really. Mostly bus lines and things. So I've redone completely redone the bus lines. Uh, we see we now have. Oh, we need to name this something. This is a uh, poplar, uh, poplar, um, poplar. Uh, I don't know what to call it. I've got express, circular, and direct. I don't know what what other words you use for for bus routes. Poplar. Um, um, Poplar. <laughs> Let me try Circ circular. We've used. I'm trying to think what the what the bus routes are ran by me. There's the circular. There's the express into town. Um, well, we'll call this an express because it's pretty much a direct. Oops. Direct route back and forth. So you can see now we have uh, one that runs from Poplar Hills up to Coleridge. Uh, we have one that runs around Hickory Circle into this whatever this new area is going to be called. Um, and then Beach Heights and Wood Districts have got a couple that run through themselves as well. So pretty much everywhere's covered. I think what I'll do eventually is once this area is done, we'll do a bus route down into Poplar Hills from here, but also into uh, the area that we're going to be working on today. Because you'll see there's a massive demand for industry and offices. Uh, also, it's probably not telling me that it needs educated workers. Um, so uneducated... It has six out of the one it needs. Well educated. It needs highly educated ones. So I think actually, before we start working on the industry area, which we're going to do farming over there, we actually need a university. I think that's unlocked. Basically, what, I see, what seems to be the, the plan uh, with the game here is that um, when it unlocks something here, it, it, the, 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 um, the city automatically needs it basically. So as soon as something unlocks here, they, the city decides it needs one. So uh, uh, university was unlocked last time, I'm pretty sure. Uh, apologies, by the way, if you can hear some blowing. I've got the fan on the back in the background. Uh, it's very warm here today. Uh, so we've got... Uh, oh, the hydro power plant's opened as well. That's cool. Um, I don't know. Maybe, maybe university was the one before. Uh, either way, it's something we need to do. Uh, was it the one before, was it? Whoops. Was it small city? Uh, that's what we just looked at. Big town, uh, zones, buildings, university, yeah. So I think that's something we're going to have to do. And I like the idea of building quite a big university campus, probably in this middle bit here. So let's carry on this road out of the way uh, using this. I've got a feeling we're going to have a bit of an issue with this park here. Yeah, what are you... Yeah, it's basically that park. But to be honest, this whole little row of houses is probably going to have to get gone as well. Uh, sorry, nobody's going to like that. We'll, we'll replace it. Um, so let's go to 18. And we'll do the same that way. 18. 
So we're going to get a nice curve there. Yeah, okay, I'm kind of happy. Yeah, these few houses aren't going to be happy. I'm sorry, though. You're living in a city. These, these things happen. Um, for, as for getting that right, I guess it's there, is it? Yeah, that looks pretty good. I mean, it's not quite right. Let's see if we can figure out a way of doing that a bit better. Um, it would be here, wouldn't it? Oops. Yeah, making a line that way. And then doing the curve. Any line we can join onto? Like that. Make that 90. No. Like, oh, there, that'll do. Uh, that's a bit better. Good. Okay, so now we can get rid of that and that, and then we should be able to carry on these now. And let's go. Let's head to go, to go over there, um, and then join that. And we'll be able to join that up. There we go. Nice straight bit of uh, straight bit of road down there until we won't have to sort about that for a little while now yet. But let's just turn all these around like that. Okay. All right, good. So yeah, these these houses aren't going to be too happy about this. So I'll tell you what we'll do then instead. Let's put a park uh, where these few houses were, and it'll hopefully sort of, you know, what is it? Playgrounds? Yeah, playgrounds fine. And let's put a little there, uh, put a little path, just going into the playground from this side. Um, we need to do control A, I think it is. Oh, and shift P as well, is it? Let's turn every, all the anarchies on. Anarchy, anarchy, anarchy. High, too high. Oh. What needs to be on the ground? There we go. That's what I was trying to do. Uh, get a path open that way. I mean, that's maybe going onto a bit of a main road there, but we'll deal with it. It's okay. Uh, so that's that done. That kind of gives us the, the space here. I'd like this to be the university area. Um, don't really want to be able to get to it from the highway. Um, worry it may push a little bit too much traffic through here, though. So, I mean, perhaps, actually, perhaps another little inter intersection here down to, you know, connecting this one up might be uh, not a bad idea. So let's, um, let's quickly do that. Let's try... Uh, this isn't something we're going to be doing very often, but let's try a little bit of a time lapse. Uh, why not? Eh? <laughs> Okay, there we go. That's the uh, the basic sort of layout for the area. I've gone for a dead standard sort of interchange here. These just seem to work, so kind of happy keeping them going as they are at the moment. 
Uh, although we do need to twist a few things around. That one's right, that one's right, that one's right. It's just that one needs to swizz around. There we go. Okay. Um, so this is going to be... I mean, this whole thing isn't going to be the university area, but, uh, you know, it's going to make up a fair chunk of it. So let's go to education. Um, that's the actual university. So it's, it's The actual building itself isn't that big, is it? Um, we'll go down to a regular... We'll do quite a nice road coming off, and we'll come off from here, I think. Um, and we'll do a nice, fair old road up. This can be this is going to be quite an upmarket uh, university. This is all right. So, yeah, nice. This is where the uh, this is a good university. People will come here from a long way away to to come and study here. Like that, and then back to the road. Okay. Uh, and then we'll have a little shoot off here as well. Okay, because I mean, I'd like residential around here, but I've got a feeling I'm not sure actually whether it'll work. Uh, obviously, you know, some we want some flats really to uh, for where the students will live. You know, a campus—that's the word I was looking for. So we'll see. Uh, university. Can we not? Oh, I was hoping we could just stick you on that corner, but we can get you there. Okay, we'll put you down there. That makes pretty much everyone in the city happy. Yeah, great stuff. So that means they're all pretty much covered by this uni. So let's uh, so look what it looks like, first of all. I mean, it's quite a cool building. A uh, bit of a car park, but it needs a lot more stuff on it, I think. Uh, one of which being a stadium, which I'm pretty sure we have unlocked now. Yeah, here it is. I was having a look before. Um, so, we, yeah, this is a... a Considering this to be more of a sort of typical um, American university uh, or college, where um, where really like it, like it, if the sport is a big thing, you know, um, I'd like to move you. Building already exists. What one? Oh, can you only have one of them? I want to just. I want to move that one. There we go. Uh, must be places along the roadside. I know. Uh, only there. Is that actually hell? Is that actually? Do people like that being there? No, it's a bit far out, isn't it, for a lot of people actually? Uh, okay. Well, I'm going to go with it because I think it looks the part anyway. So I want to fill a lot of this space in with car parking. You know, I imagine this would be a huge car parking area. So let's have a look what we've got. Uh, that's one I made myself. That's an interesting one. Underground. Mm. Um, what are the all the what are all the parking under? Is it just parking? Here we go. Uh, gated parking lot A. Let's have a look what you look like. Uh, pretty good. Uh, the floor's a bit bobbly, but we can fix that. But I don't actually like the gates around it. I want it to be all open. So I'll get rid of you. But the uh, the the things there. So closed ends. Do you know? You're not really right, are you? Um, let's have a look. There must be... Here we go. Plain open ends. That's just sort of like a dead standard sort of car park. I was hoping more for the... Uh, the other ones that are a bit more... Uh, usable with different spaces. Let's have a look. See if we can find them here. Let's see if they're on. Like loads of different strips that you can just sort of keep adding together. Here we go. Um... No, see, they don't really look great either, do they? What's this thing? Skate park. Cool. We can put one of those down here. Yeah, they look a bit random because of the uh, where the disabled spaces sit. So let's head back down towards the other ones. I think they're the ones we're going to have to use. Uh, let's have a look. A big one, nine by six. That could uh, that could do what we want it to do. If we have that there. There's nine by six. And um, let's just close that off a sec. Yeah, that's more like it. We've got some tables down by the front on the left here. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Uh, Terrain-wise, we need to try and smooth this terrain out a little bit. Is that level? Yeah. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do at all. Yeah, that's more like it. 
train the train system is funky in this game but that's that's not bad i think if we turn terrain off you'll see that it's near enough flat now okay that looks good um so really what we want to do now is add some concrete uh into the space in between which we can do i'm sure where's that little oh, so we have these decals they're quite nice aren't they um do something like a little plaza. Hmm. I have a play around with that off camera. Uh, here, are. this is the sort of stuff we want. Uh, let's turn prop anarchy off for a minute because I oh, and also that road anarchy because I really want one there. There we go. Um, there we go. See, painting tool might be better for this actually. Where are you? Uh, this one. Yeah, that's better. There we go. Okay, um, let's have you just follow this line roughly, and then we'll neaten that line up off camera. So let's just do that and that and that. Okay, and then we'll join you up on this side as well. Can we make the brush a bit bigger? Oh, yeah, we can. Awesome. Yeah, there we go. That's the sort of thing I was looking for. Let's just see if we can smooth this train a little more here. Wow. I mean, that's, uh, yeah, okay, it'll do. Uh, right, so we've got a nice big car park there. We need to make these look a little bit nicer. I think one of the things I remember seeing on my travels through the stuff I downloaded is were like some grassy, um, like islandy type bits. But I really don't know what they were called. Um, they were like sort of like round grass areas for use on like roundabouts or or like um, intersections and things uh, all right I'm gonna have a little play see if I can find them and then when I get back is that a tractor what the hell is that thing yeah some sort of tractor uh, all right I'll have a look for what I'm looking for and then when I find them I'll come back to you here we go I found them they're called planters uh, curb planters oval uh, I think these will be really nice to help break up a bit of it we've got circles we've got uh, sort of weirder shaped ones, squares, small squares, uh, small circles. Yeah, these are these are exactly the sort of thing I was looking for. What's that? Uh, Mark it. Uh, all right, I'm hoping that we can then put some uh, trees on these as well, and I think they'll look really nice. So I'm kind of thinking they should go just like a run down the middle of these two areas. So it might be worth putting a, a line on them. Uh, so I'm a bit of a of a gap on him. Oops. Yeah. Um, we need to put the anarchy thingy on. Where is it? There we go. That should now play somewhere we want. Okay. So that's the middle of the first one. So that should be about there. And they need to be a little less spread out. There we go. I mean, to be honest with you, the time that's took, it would have been easy to put three down. But at least we know that they're lined up, you know? Uh, so. Let's do a nice tree. Uh, we could do some palms, you know, make them very much, uh, you know, fake. You know, these, these these things would grow here, but they wouldn't grow naturally, you know. Um, so I think, yeah, Canary Island date palm. That looks pretty good. What about this one? Let's have a look what you look like. Oh, you're nice. Uh, we have quite a few palms to pick from. So you're a bit too big, I think. Uh, what about you? Oh, you're quite cute as well. Lots of nice trees to pick from. You're a bit too small. But I think I'm going to go for this one here. Yeah. Uh, but let's do the spacing a little less. So we can get... Mm, I'm going to try and get three in each one, but... Three might actually be a bit too much. No, that's okay. Three. Oh, here we go. And... Oops. Three. There we go. Oh, you're. You see, that's kind of going to be the problem here. Is that because it's a bit random? Uh, why can't I bulldoze? What? What is going on? Why are you? 
I don't know why, but bulldozers for some reason isn't bulldozing. Uh, yeah, I don't like you. Um, you're just a bit too extreme. So I'm going to do that. I'm actually just going to copy these ones over. Um, I quite like you. You look pretty good. So I'll put you there. Oh, so it's random. Okay, good. Um, well, let's see what happens. If I get a really big one. We can just get rid of it again. Those two aren't too bad. They are a little bigger though. It's weird. But I think it's okay. They, they can be the first ones that get planted. Uh, good. So that's a little bit of detail in there. Just to kind of break up the car park with the stadium. And then the university itself. I've also placed this down this like admin building here. Again, just to kind of be another uh, another building for, uh, for, for, the, for the uni, basically. You know, sort of extra extra buildings. It's actually classes as a... Uh, I don't know what it classes as actually. Entertainment? It's an, it looks like an entertainment building. Tourist building. But that's fine. Um, I want to move you. Um, so can we do that? Move it back a little off the uh, off the area there and just lift it up a little as well. So the actual road itself is a bit funky so I'm trying to get it somewhere in the middle. That seems about right. Uh, okay, and then I want to look back at these planters and see if there's a small one. Let's have a look. Wooden box planter. Now you're more of a uh, thing for an old bloke's garden type thing. Uh, city fuel planter. Let's have a look at what you look like. Oh, you're quite nice. Not really what I'm looking for though. Um, ah, yes, this is the sort of thing I'm looking for. Ah, oh, this is perfect. So look at you. Yeah, that's kind of the exact sort of thing I'm looking for. Let's just see if there's a one of these ones small that works as well. Um, ooh, that's tough. I think I'm going to go for that one. Um, why run I can't use B to bulldoze? I'm going to go for that one um, because it suits the matches the ones over there. So let's do. Um, Let's have a look at our numbers. Let's put spacing at eight. And start there. And then that's a little bit too often. So let's try 18. Yeah, that's pretty good. We'll start a bit further in. And we'll do five like that. Okay, here's the plan then, folks, is to put them down like so. And then find that nice uh, palm tree that we had before. I think it was that one, wasn't it? And do the same with those. See if we can get them in the middle of the planters. Uh, they have different numbers. I think we decided on 18, didn't we? So there, they should line up. Oh, they do as well. Look at that. See, we're always learning. We're learning new things every single time uh, that we can do to make cool looking palms there we go that looks good I mean they are they are they're huge but you know it's fine I'm gonna go with it uh, unfortunately I don't think I can get rid of the the random ones in the university but that's okay we can have some of those as well uh, now another thing I quite like the idea of doing uh, was trying to smooth this terrain out a little bit um, do we have a smooth yeah soften there we go that's kind of what we oh we should have done that over here really shouldn't we actually probably really help so we're gonna soften this terrain a little um, because one of the things I found when I was just searching through things, I don't know where half of this stuff has come from, but there is an event, um, video screen, casino, and then aluminium art. I don't know why event comes up for that, but there are these, look, these event tents. Uh, they're all, I'm hoping, different colours once you put them down, and they are as well. Okay, so what I was thinking was, um, one thing I see in movies all the time, uh, when they when the kid goes to uni in whatever uh, is they have these uh, tense areas where people sign up for um, societies and, and clubs and things so I thought that would be quite cool would make a little one of those uh, so let's go back to our concrete for a second uh, which is here uh, oh no no we, we're not gonna use that one are we we, we should be able to use this one it's just remembering where everything is uh, let's just knock the size down a little though. There we go. Yeah, see, we'll do this and um, 
don't know why bulldozers are working, but I can't remember to do that for now. So this area, I mean, I'll, we'll figure out the back of it and everything as well, but what I would like is some, uh, some of these big decals, first of all. Let's do them. Uh, exposed cobble. Yeah, I want this to look a bit like run-down area. This is where all the stuff goes on. Uh, road damage. You're a bit dark, really, aren't you? Um, oops. I don't know why that stopped working. Let's have a look. Seaweed. Oh, God, no. Road damage. You're a bit too devy as well. I just want some, like, light... Uh, light areas. So a bit of... Yeah, this sort of stuff. Wet, yeah, a bit of wet... Yeah, this is good. A little bit of wetness. You can't go wrong with a bit of wetness. This is good. Just to kind of break up. Oops. Didn't really want to do that one, though. Get a bit out of the way. Uh, what else we got? Road wear. Oh, these are cool. For putting them there, like, aren't they? Yeah, that's good. Oh, I like them. Uh, more stain. Oh, yeah, this is the sort of thing I was looking for, definitely. In fact, I'm going to put some of these over uh, here as well. Yeah, this is definitely the sort of thing, you know, where, the, where these tents are sort of in and out all the time. Broken glass. So a bit of broken glass, you know. These are students, they come and party. Uh, seashells we don't want. Uh, panels, oh they're interesting. Bit of car parking. Yes, this is, these are really good. Uh, you know, look, do donuts, you know, these are, you know, like I say, students come, mess around, get kicked off campus on the last day, that sort of thing. Just sort of makes it look a little bit more realistic, doesn't it? Um, there are your actual puddles, I'm not too worried about you. Um, cracks. Yeah, you're quite good as well. I'm not going to go over the top. Um, but yeah, a few bits of these. Good stuff. Okay, so let's get back to those event tents. There we go. I think we should have them like lined up. Is there a back to them? Yeah, that's the back to them there. So, I mean, I think they're floating. That's okay. Can fix that. It's probably just because the floor's flat. There we go. Um, right. What else have we got that will work well with these? I think. I wonder. Um, let's have a look if, if they have any barrels, like small barrels, that we can use as like uh, beer kegs type thing. I don't know. I'm, I know I'm hitting all the stereotypes here. I don't even know what you are. What are you? Traffic barrel. No, that's no good. But yeah, maybe something like that. There we go. Um, uh, flags. What sort of flags have we got? Uh, we have one here that changes. Oh, changes where you place it. Okay, that's cool. Let's see what there is. Germany, France, UK. Uh, I don't know. We, that's Germany or that's Germany. I'm not sure. I'm not very good at them. Well, let's have a. We'll have one can have a. Uh, a, a German, that's the German group. Oh, Spain was there. Should we have a Spanish one as well? See if we can find it again. It's weird that it works like this, but it's fine. I'll go with it. Um, or oh, France, why not? Okay. They turn with me. That's strange. Uh, there was there were other flags, but they were called like tree sign or something. Um, they were definitely down as trees. Let's have a look. See if I can find them again. They were like little open sail flags. Um, that sat on here, these banner sail. Let's have a look at them all those. All those then. Banner. Yeah, these are good. Now open, what do you sit like? Oh, you're quite cool. I mean, I know you say now open, but we could put you like here and then using move it. No. Uh, let's just put a couple more of these down first, because we do... Oh, that's weird, your class is a tree. Okay, that's good. Uh, I really want to use Move It. There we go. We should be able to get into that, there we go. Uh, 
lift you up so you're stuck on top there we go uh, okay let's have a look if there's like some benches that look suitable um ice bench maybe just like a little bit of detailing at the front here and then probably a few of these so sort of just like traditional there we go and then i think one of the other things we can do and whether this works i just don't know um should probably have a couple of bike racks here um yeah uh was it park they called i remember seeing a thing where you could put it down and it would make people congregate um PPG, I think it might have been called. Hmm. Um, yes, P Park People Generator. One by one, two by two, three by three. So if I put that there, I mean, we'll have to let the game run and see if actually people end up coming over to here. I don't know. Uh, there's no water. Oh, see, I forget about all the proper stuff we need to add. <laughs> Just making things look pretty is all we need to do. Uh, okay, let's have a look here. Do a bit of water down here. Let's just turn angle off for a minute. So we can follow the road. There we go. And power-wise, are you okay? Yeah, power is covered. That's good. All right. So now we just need to see if people actually come to uni. I hope my worry is that it's too far away. But let's have a look. There is nobody in uni so far. Um, I know, there are 1,300 students. Where the hell are they all then? Okay. Yes. Here he is. No, no, no. Come back here. You were my first people. Earl Hancock. You'll get, you're a Lowell senior. What? I hope that's a senior as in senior in uni and not senior in uh, as in you're just an old bloke who's come to hang out at the university. <laughs> His car is there. Okay. Uh, I think more car parks is probably what's needed. Let's run, a, let's run a little path around the back here. Two lane plain street. Let's do this. Um, Yeah, let's let's have this running along the back here. Like so. And let's just uh actually no, we'll keep that we'll keep this grassy edge going. Um Oh my god. Uh let's just get rid of you. Uh where's the road? Road, road, there we go. So we'll have you come out a little bit more. There we go. And then you should be able to join there, which joins across there and to get whatever we want to do in the end as well. Bulldoze is really plain up. Any suggestion, any reasons why that's happening, please let me know. Uh, so what I want to do here then is add some more planters in. And then we're going to probably have to call it a day. Uh, I have absolutely no idea how long this video is. So hopefully it's about the right sort of length. Let's have a look. Planters... Did I say they were called planters? I did. Good. Uh, not you. I want the, kind of want the opposite of you. You don't exist. Yeah, like a... Hmm. Like, not if you really fit. Like, I was looking at the opposite of that, because you sit nicely there. You need a corner one to sit the other way. Uh, okay, maybe not. I'll have a think about that. Oh, look at this, how high it is. That's not good, is it? Um... Knock you down just a little, and then we see if we can just smooth terrain out a little. There we go, that's better, isn't it? Perfect. Okay, good. So the uni is operational. We've still got a lot of work to do around there, but 
I would say that's a pretty good start. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please give us a like. It really does help at the channel. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Any thoughts, queries, or suggestions, pop it down in the comments. And if you fancy a chat, you can find me on Twitter. I'm at John T. Sparrow. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next one.